guys. Are you guys attending the workshop today yeah. for applying PhD? <laughs> there was a workshop for PhD preparation with Dr. Reed last Thursday and I was not sure attending the workshop or not because um, I have no plan for applying PhD degree for my next step. Oh. But we never know what's the future so learning never stops so i attended the conference and it was very are you guys planning to apply phd after this program uh, after yes. you graduate yes it is it's my goal it's oh my goal. so you're because there's going to be lots of parts of the phd program that are very difficult and so they want to try to see who's strong who's weak you can stick with it when they have an obstacle to jump over, so just keep that in mind. The reason, uh, you know, you should want to get a PhD, you should enjoy studying, not just do it to do it, because it is such a long process. And so that's why it's important to get a school that you like and a program that you like, because... I I linguistics. So I wonder if those names affect our PhD choice or no it's it's only affected by what you want to do mm -hmm. now, obviously you know if you want to go into chemical engineering that's not going to help you <laughs> but anything related to language even curriculum even uh, education degree it doesn't matter it's what you want to do what you like this all for 28 years where I really want to go but your PhD program's gonna wanna know, even if you change later, I think I wanna be <coughs> a program administrator. I'd like to do either this or that. But they don't wanna hear, I have no idea, I, you know, I don't have a job, and so that's, don't know what to do with myself, so I'd like to come to your school. I think that's not the workshop was a very informative and gave me the ideas and the steps to applying PhD degree but to be honest I'm still not sure PhD degree itself it's a very long commitment and it's absolutely worth it to do that if you want it and if you need it but like in my case I I think all I need and want related to TSO field, I think I learn it all through MATSO, and I'm kind of person to learn through experience and mistakes. If you missed the workshop but you wanted to know the procedure or have some information, you can contact to me. I still keep the handout with me.